to go on the side of our uh, duck, we're going to do um, haricot vert. These are French, um, beautiful French uh, string beans. Um, they're a little thinner than the American string bean. And we're going to do a recipe. We're going to start by steaming them, then put them into a fry pan with some butter and olive oil. We have some toasted slivered almonds here, which we're going to put on top, and then give it a nice fresh squeeze of lemon. Um, so first step is to take uh, our green beans. This is enough for about five here. And I have my steamer over here and have the temperature between 140 and 160. Um, this is a beautiful steamer from WMF in Germany. I've never seen anything like it. Um, it's so nice having a temperature gauge. So I'm gonna just go ahead and put those in there. And I'm gonna set my timer for about four minutes. In the meantime, I'm gonna have a frying pan set up in the front here. And what I wanna do is uh, heat that up as well at the same time, get that hot. And what we're going to do is we're going to uh, saute it uh, after the stream beans are done in four minutes in uh, butter and olive oil. Okay, so our beans have been cooking for about four minutes. And so now I've got my fry pan heating over here on medium and non-stick pan. And I'm going to put about a tablespoon of unsalted butter in there. And to that I'm going to add um, some olive oil. This is the Casas de Hualdo. Um, this is the Piquao, which is a, a fruity, medium-bodied olive oil, which is excellent with green beans. The fruitiness is very nice with vegetables. And I'm going to put about a tablespoon of that in the pan along with the butter. Let all of that melt to get hot. And then we just take our beans out of the steamer, right into the fry pan. You want them to sort of coat the green beans in olive oil and butter. Is the idea. You see they're nicely coated now. And what I'm going to do is finish it off with my toasted almonds. with some tortoiseau. This is a Sonia de Camargue. Beautiful tortoiseau that's dried in the sun in the south of France. And that will give the beans a beautiful flavor. And that's all set. I'm going to go ahead and shut that off and let it stay warm while I finish the duck here in front of us.